Bam, welcome back to Tabs, everybody. Uh, we're still playing the Orc Invasion campaign. Conquer the island. When you finally reach the island, you have to face off against a massive army of humans and other things that really want to keep their island. Just like big spear block. Oh, the pharaohs are here. They got a couple of blisters, very nice. Old Zeus Artemis, oh jeez. Bunch of snacks and uh, cupids. Well, I feel like this should be fine. 40,000 bucks, that's a lot of bucks. We'll bring the king. Very good. Oh man, I do like these hunters. Like, the fact that they've got dodge makes them really handy in archer duels. Three orc brutes. Okay, right, we've got, we've got like a bit of a menagerie going on here. Um, bonk. Ooh. Okay, how's the flame doing? Flame is okay. Ah, uh, you know, it's, uh, flame's pretty good. I'm, I'm into the flamethrower. Like, when you get in range, it really does, like, start sapping the health. Okay, pretty good. Not a big fan of pharaohs. Great work! Oh, man, the trackers at the back. You did just fantastically. Um, you guys look real cool. Take that. And you. Okay, don't, don't do silly shouting. Oh, no. He's, he's in kissy mode. We had... We had meetings about this. Ugluck. That's his name. Okay, the trackers. Man, those trackers are doing just fantastic work again. Oh, mine at all. Hello. Ooh, this is going to be harder work. This is going to be much harder work. All trying to get up here at once. Uh, oh, God, that's such a good defendable position. Nice. Okay, right. A few more arrows. And what have they got? Like, banner bearer? Banner bearer and snake? Yeah, I don't think. I don't think these guys are going to be able to do it at all. Oh, good job. Wow. Excellent shooting. Dynasty army. The next enemy is the faraway dynasty. With their well-trained warriors and strange but devastating technologies. They have a whole load of samurai, a bunch of dagrons, and a couple of hotchars just hanging out. I feel like we've got to like mix up the strat a bit though. Get some of these slicers in, because they are strong against arrows. Can you deflect hotchar arrows? I honestly can't remember. Uh, of course the king is going to come. Let's get a shaman on each flank, see if that helps. And then... I'm not going to bother with too much range this time. Oh, I see. I take that back. Have a catapult each. Okay, they do have a lot of dudes. I'm kind of worried about that. Oh, is that catapult even going to be worthwhile? Okay, watch out. Honestly, did do a lot. Um, Slicer, please do not jump off the edge. They are trying to poke you off the edge. This is like gladiators all over again. And that's when you were defeated by, um, Wolf? Was Wolf? Was he, like, the bad boy of gladiators? And a slicer. Oh, he does not deflect. Okay, that's bad. Real bad for business. Um, this flank isn't going so hot either. Okay, King is certainly holding his own. But when the Huachars get, get a blast in... Can you cast one more spell? No. Okay. It's basically just the king. We do have a wizard, but he is just breakdancing instead of fighting. And we're dead or in the hole? Oh no. We live, just no, we don't. We got hotchard. Real badly. Breakdance away. Oh. Oh, you got one spite spell cast. <gasps> they can deflect it. I think he deflected one. What'd be good going in there? Like I don't just want to say Berserker again, because you get some immediate damage, but maybe just Berserkers again. Heck, we can even just have a three Orc Kings. Okay, Berserker, just like slam that bad boy into the ground, bonk. Okay, you, yeah, you easily made back 500 bucks um, and still live, which is real good. Oh god, the Monkey King's into always a hate that. Hate that. Um, right, watch out. Kind of just murdered your own your own boys. 
They're more dragons. Oh god, actually. Oh god, the dragon is really good! That dealt way more damage than I was expecting. Okay, the king is just struggling in the middle. Oh, this is a lose. Okay, we really need something to deal with. Oh, watch us. Wow, what is that one doing? Hey, babe, what are you doing? It's the world's longest dragon. Wow. Look at him go. It's so long. What the heck? Um, okay, right, what are we doing? Um, that is just a big old distraction right there. God, I feel like the orcs have got just a whole load of units that do pretty much exactly the same thing as each other. Like the berserkers, just because they blow up and then they stick around, uh, which is pretty legit. I think, I feel like they maybe get their points worth. I wonder if we just like stack the mid with orc kings. Okay, bomb guy on this flank. I feel like Bonk... For half health, he kind of gets his money's worth. Uh, those guys do not like getting rocketed. Okay, go in the middle. The Berserker in the middle doesn't actually do nearly as much. Okay, can you guys deal with the Monkey King fast enough? This guy just having a whale of a time down in the river. Um, I feel like maybe the flanks are good. Maybe mid doesn't need a Berserker. I just need something to get in there fast. Man, monks are monks are really tough, actually, when you think about it. Like, they, those guys have taken like a real, real good whaling on. Uh oh. Ooh, they killed their own dragon. That feels good. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like the. They just have a gun line shooting into my flank. That feels super bad. Uh, oh god, the dragon. The dragon's just getting just raw DPS on us. Okay, it is just a bloodbath in there. Whoa, do a barrel roll. Spreading, that's a good trick. I'll try spinning, that's a good trick. Don't try it. Okay, like we just do not punch through that middle nearly fast enough. I don't know, we still have some guys in there. Please don't go down the hole, you are so dangerously close to the hole. Wow, god, maybe. I don't have a lot of guys left. Man, I still had like a thousand bucks. I feel like just five archers would actually add a good little bit of DPS that I would need. Please do not just get a little turn. Oh my god, wow. We've actually done it, man. I was, I was already like formulating, formulating my next plan. But as long as they don't fall down the hole, both of you, I see you're both trying to fall down the hole. No, you're, you're okay. Watch out for that rocket. Bonk. Oh god, please don't lose now. There's water and holes. Oh, good job. Finish them off. You've pushed back the leaders of the dynasty with their backs to the hole. Finish them off. There we go. Shouts, shouts and flames. Yeah, that, that looks that looks pretty nice. Oh, they do have shurikens. Uh, oh man, not actually that many went in the holes. They kind of all like bounced around it. Uh, God, that guy does a lot of damage. And we are not doing a lot of damage. Uh, we've kind of dealt with everyone else. But it's just like 20, 20 seconds to kill a giant. Oh, they do some good hits. They could still push him in the water. Will he actually die from this? Oh, look at that damage. Ooh. What a big boy. Horses and pikes! The next place you want to conquer is the Renaissance City. Prepare to deal with some of the most advanced weaponry of this era. Horses and pikes. They've got guns on the wall. You guys are on like cav duty. And then hopefully to go and kill kill the guys upstairs. Just like a gigantic horde of goblins. Okay, halberds, gobbos. We've still got like a bit of cash. I don't think it would hurt to get a few of those hunters just like kind of scattered back okay right how well does flamethrowers deal with pikemen okay the berserkers did not make it in 
Oh, I don't like that the cav instantly have gone for my cannons. Cannons are doing okay. Not amazingly. Wow, the horses do not like pikemen. Who would have thought? Their mortal foe. God, wow, those pikemen really just took them down. Wow, the horses just murdering goblins. Wow, it does so much damage to the gobos. Just walking into them. I didn't realize that's how it kind of, kind of worked. Okay, there still is a load of guns. But they do know to target the gobos first. Oh man, the cannons are going to really create a big... Just a big blockage up here. Okay, yeah, stay low when they take a shot. Oh, okay, right, it didn't, didn't work that well. They have killed one of their own banners, though. Gobos. Bloody thousands of them. <laughs> Come on, Gobbo. Can you do it? You're just short enough that they might not be able to get you. Oh. 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 Gobbo lives. Oh, he doesn't kill in one hit, though, which is real bad news for him. Come on, are you the bravest goblin? Oh. He died. It's fine. There are more to take his place. Uh, the plan kind of kind of worked. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, God. The genius. Da Vinci didn't appreciate that you planned to conquer his city and cloned himself, build two nearly functional tanks, and armed the peasants with balloon backpacks to use them as a distraction. Sure. Those are words. Loads of balloon boys. He's got, like, halberds, mega cannons. God, this actually looks kind of a fair bit tougher. I feel like every faction can have an Orc King to fight. That is points. So uh, we've got some like Kings. Kings going around. They're shouting at people. Wow, this one actually does really good work. Gets some great value on, uh, you know, drowning. Drowning folks. Good job. And I hope the Gobos are enough of a distraction so they don't just target the Kings. So I've kind of been noticing, the Kings the kings are tough, but their damage output is not, not as high. How's my little archer group doing? You're just here for, like, the DPS. To try and, like, plink, plink some of their shooties. God, they all, like, super dodge when a straight arrow comes through. Uh-oh. Watch out for cannonballs. They're gonna, that's gonna hurt. Uh, you guys better fire a little bit faster. Oh no, they're in. Oh, my boys! Damn you, ballooners. You just crazy, crazy folks. Da Vinci. You dog. Please, just attack. Uh-oh. Oh no, he came off and... He's still blocking arrows in the air, which I like, but... Oof. Oh, you know what? That wasn't too much damage. Please don't fall in the water. Come on. Fight properly. Just kill. Oh, ooh, good shout. See ya. <laughs> We've got like a smattering of folks left to attack. But it is not taking damage. Oh, wow. Okay, it just died. Okay, who's going to get the wall profit? Ooh, they are close. Oh, right in the kidney. Excellent. Ten points. Ten points to you. The gate to heaven. Finally, you get to your last enemy. The only kingdom standing between you and world domination. The Cloud City. Okay, geez, this is kind of like the defense that I had, but with more elephants. Defeat the blue team and survive 45 seconds. Okay, what about that? Oh, what about here? What about here? Okay, right, I'm allowed on these bits, just not one step below. <laughs> okay. Right, there are elephants. Okay, they're killing themselves. That's great. I guess it's the elephants. God, there's so many elephants. <laughs> I've got to achieve. The last resistance. Finally, after all this hard work, you're finally closer to achieving your dream of world domination than ever before. However, there is still one challenge left. Defeat the Chronomancer, the Lord of the Cloud City. Cloud City? It's Lando. Lando's in charge of Cloud City. Uh, and the most powerful being in this world. And no one will stand between you and world domination. 
I think we're talking about a different Cloud City. Uh, you're the Chronomancer. We can probably deal with you. I think arrows is how I will do that. I think shouting at them feels like a very good plan. These tall, the side orc kings are going to have a really bad time. Oh, maybe like berserkers in there. Why, why the hell not? Okay, I want everyone to shout and keep them all nicely constrained. Excellent. Very good. Please don't use magic hammers. Bonk. Feels bad. Okay, I don't think the explosions actually did all that much work. Oh, heal auras. Not the one. The shouting is doing great victory. What killed him? Oh. Okay, I found his clock. Right, I'm pretty sure a shout pushed him directly out of this window and all the way back here because you can just see here that's my target we just blast him off the map man so good at games victory thank you for completing the orc invasion campaign well thank you for making it that was a that was a lot of fun real cool i hope you guys enjoy seeing some tabs uh that maybe there'll be some more coming in the future maybe not who knows until next time Goodbye.